question for the New York. And then we get lost. We all will, you will. Which just means you get caught up in your thinking and it seems real again. It's part of being a human being. You know, part of it. And so that's going to happen because we are spiritual beings, but we live in a physical world, and we have physical bodies, and so you can't help but to be looking out here and seeing stuff and thinking about it. <coughs> and then you get lost because thought is invisible. So I don't know anybody who in every <coughs> moment sees the invisible nature of life manifesting in every moment. So times you see it and then you get lost. And then when you wake up and you realize you've been lost, don't be hard on yourself. Be grateful you've seen it. You can always get a fresh start. Right at that moment you get a fresh start. Just as you are. Remember I said it's a come as you are party. The place to be in is not a good feeling. The place to be in is wherever you are with an understanding that allows you to realize that you're just experiencing your thinking and that you're connected to something absolutely beautiful and wise. And you become more oriented toward just being open to that coming into you and living you and coming through you. because I would so often become confused because I wouldn't know what to do because I'd have one thought, maybe, well, maybe I should do this, and then no thought, no, do this. And I would go back and forth in my head between those two ideas. And I would try to figure out which of those two was better. And the more I thought about it, the more confused I would get. Or I would end up just being sort of really ambivalent and I wouldn't act on things. And people say, what are you going to do? I don't know. And I, I get more and more anxious thinking about it, so I procrastinate or I put it off, or, or I get so tired of feeling that way, I would just go off and just impulsively do one thing or the other. Mm -hmm. And then a friend of mine helped me and said, well, those are just thoughts, Dick, and you should, you shouldn't. It's two different thoughts. You let go of both of them. Your mind clears, something new can come in. So stop looking here in memory and be open to something new. And I began to discover that it was a thousand times easier to do that than to struggle and stay confused.